Welcome to your weekly buzz, presented by Speaking Unity. Here's what's happening this week on the buzz. Early in 2019, LinkedIn added manual alt text for users who wanted to add descriptions to uploaded photos, diagrams, and illustrations, and to provide info to visually impaired connections in their network. Now, LinkedIn has updated alt text from manual to automatic. This ensures everyone using LinkedIn can be more inclusive with their posts and not alienate prospective connections. After all, networking is about getting the most connections. It will be worth watching to see if LinkedIn's new feature accurately describes intricate images, or will alt text automatically alienate the people it's trying to reach. Here's what's happening this week on The Buzz! Originally announced during its 2018 F8 Developer Conference, Facebook has finally launched Facebook Dating, which allows users to create separate dating profiles that will use Facebook's hoard of data for matchmaking. That's right, users can connect Facebook and Instagram stories to their Facebook dating profile and use a feature called Secret Crush, which allows the platform's users to select Facebook friends or Instagram followers they have a crush on. This is a bold move for Facebook and so far seems to be the right one. Once Facebook made the announcement, market value for Match Group, which owns Match.com and Tinder, plummeted. The question is, will Facebook be the place to make successful lifelong matches, or will it be the site that's only good for the occasional hookup? Here's what's happening this week on The Buzz! While we're on the topic of social media, the question has recently come up if likes are a necessary part of the social experience. Facebook, in its ever-evolving quest to remain relevant, began testing a like-free version to help combat the negative effects it has on people's mental health. Social media constantly forces users to compare themselves to others. Hiding likes could allow people to focus on the content instead of the numbers and in turn cause people to like Facebook more. At least, that's the hope. In other somewhat related news, we'd be really happy if you click that like button below. And that's your weekly buzz. Get more fresh buzz at speakinghuman.com forward slash buzz.